that call the world attention That's it. to God's word. God. Amen. Amen. This is a wake up call. Oh, yes. Sounding the alarm of heaven. That's right. Ringing in the earth. That's right. We are determined mm -hmm. not to allow nobody Go ahead, brother. to come along late and mm -hmm. then go and belittle God. That's right. Muhammad well, Ali admitted. He said, I was young and brash. It's wrong for me to say mm -hmm. I am the greatest. Right. He said, yeah, I believe that this affliction comes from God. Mm -hmm. It's my trial. Yeah. He said, if, I'm, I, if I was the greatest, why can't I beat this? That's right. That's right. That's right. No man is the greatest. No man. No. No woman is the greatest. No, no. The saying is true. Allah hu Akbar. That's right. We believe it. That's right. There's none greater than God. Amen. There's none equal to God. That's right. There's none better than God. That's right. Everything else is lesser than God. Amen. Amen. Talk to me. Amen. That's right. God is great. This is what have happened to religion. That's right. Johnny come lately, lead us. Mm -hmm. Come on the scene. Amen. And want to make themselves God. Right. Johnny come lately, lead us. Lead us. Come on the scene. Mm -hmm. And want to make themselves equal, equal to God. That's right. God say, who is my equal? That's right. Say of the Holy One. The Holy One. There's none equal to him. None equal. That's right. God don't have to try That's to right. do nothing. No. God don't have to overcome nothing. nothing. See, we got to overcome. That's right. The reason why we got to overcome because that means we got to struggle. Right. With something. Amen. I don't want a God that struggles. Amen. I don't want a God that's weak. That's right. I don't want a God that have to try. That's right. I want a God that speak and make it happen. Make it happen. Amen. Glory to God. Amen. That's right. That's right. Amen. Only God can bring the non-existence mm -hmm. into existence. That's right. It ain't no man fashioned water. No, no. Huh? No, no. Here come the prophet talk about the greatness of God's vision mm -hmm. and called it lightning. Lightning. And said lightning is harder than a rock. That's right. And he atomized it. Mm -hmm. And then it says how the Lord is a son. Right. Now listen. Mm -hmm. I had a discussion when I first had it with the nation at Frankfurt Avenue. One gentleman came and said, he, he pitched a quarter on the pulpit. Right. He said, that's my God. That's my Lord. Your God is a quarter? A quarter. My Lord. He said, there is no power greater than him but another man. Mm. 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 Touching the Almighty. Mm. He the one told me I'm preaching spookism. Yeah. Yeah. The book says in Job chapter 37 and verse 23. Follow me, viewers. Touching the Almighty. T concerning. See when it says touching, mm -hmm. you can't take it literally. No. Concerning means concerning. That means concerning. Mm -hmm. The Almighty. What do you mean? I'm about to give you some information That's about right. the Almighty. That's right. Listen. Touching the Almighty. What is it? We cannot find him out. <laughs> you go to school. Yeah. But he's deeper than any university. That's right. You go to Bible college. That's right. God is deeper than your dean. That's right. You got PhDs and DDs and masters. That's right. God is deeper than any paper. That's oh, right. yes. Amen. Still can't figure him out. That's right. That's right. You try to measure heaven, mm -hmm. he's higher than that. Higher than that. Hell is bottomless. Mm -hmm. He's deeper than he's that. Deeper than that. He said he's broader than the sea mm -hmm. and longer than the earth. Amen. Who by searching? Mm -hmm can find out God. Find out God. Man try to imitate or mimic God. Right. So man called himself all type of titles. That's right. That's right. Man called himself Messiah. Mm -hmm. Years ago, there was a false prophet in the 1930s called mm -hmm. Father Divine. 
That's yeah. Right. That's right. The moment a man say he's father divine, he said he's God. That's right. But well, there's only one divine father. That's right. Hmm? Amen. Father divine mm -hmm. is dead. Right. That's right. He's he dead. He's so not so divine. No. No, no. You men that are watching me, mm -hmm. that are leading millions of all these kind of religions, mm -hmm. that have made yourself some eternal entity. That's right. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> some great divine source. Divine one. Amen. The whole earth Amen. was made for God's glory. That's right. You was made to live for him, obey him, serve him. And one thing you have in common that you don't have in common with God, mm -hmm. death. Death. That's right. We are God's. Mm -hmm. In St. John chapter 10. Ye mm -hmm. are God. Ye are. That's right. Let's explain this. St. John chapter 10 and we're at verse 34. I, I want to talk about God for a little bit. Amen. If you don't mind. Amen. If you do mind, I'm going to talk about him anyway. That's right. Listen. Jesus answered them. Jesus answered them. Is it not written in your law? Is it not written in your law? I said ye, or, ye are gods. I said ye are gods. If he called them Hold gods. It. Let's talk about that. Talk about that. Right. Ye. Ye are gods. Are gods. Mm -hmm. Ye are gods. Ye are gods. <laughs> In Psalms 82 and that Now, even Satan. That's right. Had this knowledge. That's right. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Back in the Garden of Eden. Mm -hmm. He informed the woman that they ye eat thereof. Mm -hmm. The Lord know you shall be as gods. As gods. That's what he said. That's right. So when it says ye are gods, it doesn't mean you shall be equal to the creator. No. Let's go to the book of Genesis. Son of Adam, I this. In Genesis chapter 3. Glory to God. Get me good. And we'll begin at verse 3. What is it? But of the fruit of the tree which is in the midst of the garden. Yeah. God has said ye shall not eat of it, neither shall ye touch God it. God said ye shouldn't eat it and ye shouldn't touch it. Lest ye die. And lest ye die. And the serpent said unto the woman. The devil said to the woman. Ye shall not surely die. That's that lying spirit. That's right. That lying spirit. That's right. He want to water down the truth. Mm -hmm. He want to contradict truth. Right. You, you see the way the devil's like this. He bring truth and then integrate it with the lie. That's right. You won't surely die. For God doeth know. Now he come with truth. Amen. God truly know. That in the day in the day. Thereof, you eat thereof. Then your eyes shall be open. Your eyes shall be open. And ye shall be as gods. Ye shall be as gods. And what did that mean? Knowing good and evil. That's what that means. That's, That's right. That's what it means. That's right. Eh? That's right. Glory to God. Ye shall be as gods, meaning now you shall be able to have knowledge of good and evil. And evil. That's right. What do you mean? You're going to come into the knowledge of yourself. That's right. You're going to have a self-knowledge. That's right. Huh? That's right. Now let's go back to what the apostle said. First, let's get the prophet David, the prophet. if you will. In Psalms 82 and at verse 6. I want every man that think he's God like the God of heaven right. to realize That's right. you're weak. That's right. You're feeble. Amen. You get sick. Mm -hmm. You got to use the bathroom. That's right. You need to eat. That's right. You take Tylenol. Amen. You can't sleep. You take NyQuil. That's true. You drive. God don't need a car. No. Go ahead, brother. Go ahead. God don't need a car. No. Don't, don't need it. The earth is the Lord. Everything is his. That's right. Yeah, these folk walk around from different religions claiming their leaders are God, the God of heaven. The God of heaven. And here, the leaders got to pay rent, got to <laughs> pay right. mortgage, right. they got to pay taxes. Right. And some religions, their leader was thrown in jail. They arrested God. <laughs> That's right. That's right. And now God doing a 30-year stretch. <laughs> Amen. The God of heaven don't need a lawyer. That's no, right. no. It is written that we have an advocate with the Father. That's right. He's a counselor. Go right there, God. He's a counselor. He's a, that's right. 
Thank God. Listen at what the word says. Psalms 82 and at verse 6. Listen at brother David. I have said ye are gods. I have said ye, ye are, are gods. gods. And all of you. All of you. Are children of the most high. That's what that means. Right. Because the children of the most high will have the knowledge of good and evil. And evil. That's right. That's ye it. are Your gods. gods. What do that mean? Amen. That don't mean ye are black. No. 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 That don't mean ye are white. That's right. That's right. Ye are gods. gods. Ye are gods. Meaning the reflection of God, the characteristics of God, the wisdom of God, the laws of God, the precept of God, the behavior of God are to be manifest That's right. in his people. That's right. That's right. That when I see you, I see God shining out of you. That's right. Ye are gods, meaning my body belonged to him. Amen. All right, take God, my mind belonged to him. That's right. My hands belonged to him. That's right. That's why God said, touch not. Touch not. That's right. Why? You belong to me. That's Handle right. not. That's right. Go ahead. You are God. I have said you are gods. Yes, sir. Hmm. I don't mean you are five percenters. No. No. Oh, no. That don't mean you made heaven. That's right. Mm -mm. The black man always exists. No man, no man. always exists. No, no. There's only one that's eternal. That's, that's right. And that's God. That's right. I want to say, well, where is that at? I'm about to take care In of you Psalms right now. 90. After you get 90, give me the, 20, the 12th chapter of Ecclesiastes. Mm -hmm. Let's see where the dust is going back. That's right. Listen at this. First in Psalms 90, beginning verse 1. Everybody all right? Yeah. Amen. Listen. Lord, thou hast been our dwelling place in all generations. Lord, you have been my dwelling place. In all generations. Ain't no man can be a dwelling place in all generations. No. Why? Generations die. That's, That's right. right. And then other generations come back. That's right. But Lord, thou hast been know ye the Lord, place. that he is God. He is God. Lord, thou have been our dwelling place, our dwelling place in all generations, in all generations before glory to God, before the mountains were brought. What forth. man formed the mountains? Man. Amen. Hmm? Amen. Let me meet the man that created the mountains. That's right. The book says before the mountains were brought forth, before the mountains was brought forth, God was here. Or ever thou hadst formed the earth and the world. Before you formed the earth? Wait a minute. That's right. That's right. Before the earth was? Amen. Amen. No earth, but there was God. That's right. That's right. So I want to say, well, God had to make the earth so he can live there. You can't contain God. No, no. No, no. God is bigger than the earth. That's right. My God, he lets you know how small earth is to him until he call it his footstool. That's right. Footstool. That's it. There's something to rest on. Amen. Listen. Before the mountains were brought Before forth. Before the mountains were brought forth. Or ever thou hadst formed the earth. Or ever thou hadst formed the earth. And the world. And the world. Even from everlasting. Even from where no time exists. To everlasting. To where no time will ever be. Thou art God. No limit on. No limit. That's right. Some say, well, wait a minute. If God is not a man, mm -hmm. why God addressed himself as he? He, that's right. You can't be a spirit and be called he. Mm -hmm. The book says, when he, he when he, Listen. In St. John chapter 16 and verse 13. Give, give chapter and verse. St. John chapter 16 and at verse 13. You can't be spirit and be called he. You can't. My Lord. Listen. How be it when he. How be it when he. The spirit. The spirit of what? Of truth. That's God. Amen. 
he will guide hey, you. It didn't say somebody gonna come with the spirit in them. No. no. Oh no. That's right. It didn't say that. When he, when he, the spirit, the of, truth spirit of truth is come, is come. He will guide he, you. He, the spirit gonna guide you into all truth. He gonna bring you into the complete knowledge of himself. That's right. He, he shall glorify me. He, do you hear that? That's right. This is all about God. That's, That's right. right. No man, no man, no man made the heavens and the earth. No, no. You Catholics that say Hail Mary, the mother of God. Mother. Mm -hmm. God don't have a mommy. No, he doesn't. God never was breastfed. No, no way. God never wore pampers and diapers. No, no. Eh? Amen. Glory to God, not God. Not God. Like when the Messiah was born, mm -hmm. when the Messiah was born, the Messiah was a prophet. That's right. God never was a prophet. No. A prophet is sent by God. That's right. And things are revealed to a prophet. That's right. If something is revealed to you, you didn't always know it. Know it. That's right. God know all things. That's right. That's right. My God, the body of the Messiah wasn't nothing more than working clothes. That's it. So God can work in. Who has He utilized that to redeem man back to him. That's right. Because man was contrary and hard head. Go ahead. And it took a sacrifice to atone for your wickedness. That's right. So the apostle said, heaven was searched. Mm -hmm. What you looking for? My God, I got the final remedy. The final remedy. So heaven was searched. Mm -hmm. Earth searched. Earth was searched. That's right. And he went down Under. underneath, the, underneath earth. the earth. And that was searched. That's right. Still couldn't find nobody worthy. That's right. To open the book mm -hmm. and loot the seven, seven seals, seals, seals thereof. John said, I crowd about that condition. That's right. I ain't got until the elder came and got my attention. That's right. And said, John, listen, weep not. Weep you not. stop that crying. That's right. I saw someone coming. That's right. I saw myself a whole look. The line of the tribe of Judah. The line of the tribe of Judah. The root of David. The, who? The root of David. What? The root of David. Hold it. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. The root Hallelujah. of David. Has prevailed. Hold it. Amen. Before you can be a root, you gotta be a seed. That's right. Hey? That's right. And before roots can come from that seed, you gotta be planted in dirt. That's right. The book says, Have not the scripture have said that Christ cometh of the seed of David out of the town of Bethlehem where David was. That's right. And here comes God, the Spirit, being called husband man. That's right. Husbandry is farming. That's right. The That's right. eternal God plant that seed. That's right. All that flesh. Amen. All that shape. Amen. All that body. Go ahead. All that minister. Go ahead. In the house of David. That's right. And Mary's body was dry ground. Dry, That's right. right. For he it was a root out of dry, out of dry ground. Of dry ground. Out of dry ground. Paul said, "It's quite evident." That's right. That our Lord sprang out of Judah. That's right. The body of the Son of God consists of flesh and blood. That's right. And that flesh and blood was not God. No. Let me contradict all of you devils. Mm -hmm. You say God became man. That's right. God never, 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 never no. became a man. That's right. God made a man Amen. and then took the man on That's right. that he made. That's right. And when he was finished with the man, mm -hmm. he stepped out of him That's and right. pulled him off. Pulled him off. That's right. That's right. That's it. God. Give me John. Mm -hmm. One and one. St. John chapter one and that verse Then we one. get the book of Revelation. Amen. I want to see who's riding on that white horse. That's right. Flow with the vexion. Go ahead. I want to strip it down and take it apart. Amen. Notice what the apostle John teaches us. St. John chapter one and that verse one. Listen. In the beginning. In the beginning. Was the word. Hold it. Amen. <laughs> Ignorant men say the beginning of God. No, you can't be eternal and got a beginning. No. In in the beginning. The beginning was the word. What do you mean? Word. Usage of words. Go ahead. Was brought forth to bring the non-existence into existence. That's right. In the beginning, speech introduced the beginning. That's right. Words. The English grammar, you have nouns, predicates, mm -hmm. synonyms, mm -hmm. antonyms, yes, pronouns, yes, adverbs, right. verbs. Mm -hmm. Are you listening? In the beginning. In the beginning was the word. Was the word. Speech ignited 
the beginning. That's right. That's right. Speech introduce the beginning. That's right. Are you getting what I'm telling you? Amen. Amen. God was dwelling in the thick darkness. That's right. Glory to God. That's right. God always was. Always. So he separated the light from darkness. They called the light day Amen. and the darkness night. Night. Putting time upon it. That's right. So here you have in the beginning mm -hmm. was the, the word. word. Mm -hmm. And the word was with God. Well, that don't mean somebody else is with them. No. Who's with God? Mm -hmm. A little junior God? A little. Mm -hmm. Why do he need another God with him? That's is right. he crippled? That's right. Is he handicapped? handicapped? And then you got the audacity to tell me he's the almighty, but all of a sudden he needs some help to create something. My Lord. The word was with God simply means he's a God of his word. That's right. When he speak, things just got to happen. Got to happen. Huh? That's right. See, he go along and tell you in the beginning was the word and the word was with God, meaning he's a God of his word. And who is the word? And the word was God. Same one. Same one. The word that introduced time, mm -hmm. the voice that spoke it. That's right. That was God. That's right. The word was God. was God. The speech was God. That's right. The order of things was established by God. That's right. Not by some man. No, no. The same was in the beginning. The same was in the beginning with God with God all things all things were made by him by them him no he had a partner all things were made by him how much all hey things. that include man that's right that's right man was made by him that's right black men white men yellow man red man and mm -hmm. amen that's right all things. All things. Were made by him. You see, that's why God said, ye are gods. He made you so you can reflect him. That's right. Not for you can take it literally and think that you're the almighty. Amen. All things. I, I, I preach in prisons throughout America, and I've met men that take that scripture literally, that ye are gods. Right. And told, they told me, Pastor Jennings, I can do anything. <laughs> well, you shouldn't be in jail. Amen. God, you should be able to get out when you're ready. That's right. Huh? That's right. You can do all things, and then you shouldn't be following no guard back to yourself. No. You have took the scripture and ran and with it, with and it. the devil duped you. The devil tricked you. That's right. Every man under the sun is limited in ability. Amen. Only the eternal God of the universe can do all things. That's right. What all, did he say? All things were made by him. All things, everything was made by him. And without and listen, including the devil. That's right. That's right. That's right. All things. All things. All things. He said, I create good mm -hmm. and not create evil. That's right. Devil wasn't made by a man. No. Devil ain't come out of a laboratory. That's right. How foolish. Go ahead, brother. Devil didn't come out of a tube. No, no. Take God, that devil is in a whole lot of folk. That's right. Isn't it? That's right. Listen. All things were made by him. All things were made by them. Him. Them. By him. They. By him. Everything was made by him. All things were made by him. And what? And without him. No, without them. Without him. Without them. Without him. With the, read that right. You got glasses, don't you see? And without him. Without them. Without him. Bring your God here, world. That's right. That's right. You that are watching around the world, bring, him. bring your God here. Bring him here. Amen. Amen. Some of you got to dust your God off. That's right. Some of you got to shine him up. Shine him up. Some of you, your gods need some pointing. <laughs> Cement right. fell out of him. That's right. That's Some right. of you, your God's got bird droppings on it. Amen. And he can't clean it off. He can't get it off. Some of your gods need a steam wash. That's right. Glory to God. Amen. All things were Some made. of you, your gods is on your shelf. Yeah. In the yard of your house. In the yard. Some of you in your home bowing to a picture, tapping your head. That's right. And I guarantee if that picture was to say something, you wouldn't have no head. No, you wouldn't. You right. would run out of there. That's right. That's right. 
Are you listening? They have mouths. Listen, listen at this. In Psalms 115, and we'll start at verse 4. Let's see how the prophets crush idolatry. Their idols are silver and gold. Their idols are silver and gold. You that are listening and watching in India and Pakistan right. and Afghanistan and Malaysia and other parts of the world in the Philippines mm -hmm. that have these idols for gods. Amen. Throughout America, you have made your leaders God. That's right. When a man walk in a building or come in a country, nobody should bow to him. Nobody. That's right. That's right. That's right. Nobody, nobody should bow. The Pope is not that great. That's right. The Pope is not that important. That's right. That the knees of the human race Go ahead. should bow to that mortal man. Amen. That's right. He ain't that great. Not that great. No, it's not. Huh? That's right. Glory, take God. The word says what? Their idols are silver and gold. Your idols are silver and gold. The work of men's hands. The work of men's hands. They have mouths. They have mouths. But they speak not. My viewers, Amen. Why are you bowing to statues? Oh yeah. You that are listening in India, mm -hmm. you that are bringing coconuts. When I was in India, I watched the uh, Hindus mm -hmm. bring sacrifices to their gods. That's right. Over three million gods in one country. My Lord. Over three million My Lord. in one country. My Lord. I watch sincere people mm. bring apples, mm. pineapples, coconuts, mm -hmm. nuts, nuts, bananas to their God. My Lord. Then I watch the intelligent monkeys <laughs> sit there and wait. <laughs> Yeah. That's right. Why the monkey know that God ain't gonna do nothing with it. Do nothing with it. The monkey sit back. My Lord. And the moment the people got gone, the monkeys came, ate the sacrifice. Lord. Listen to me, viewers. Amen. You are not to bow to no image. No image. That's right. We don't bow to pictures, no. images, no, no, stone. That's right. Clay, That's right. nor flesh and blood. That's right. Listen. They have mouths, but they speak not. Eyes have they, but they see not. Listen. You mean they tell me I'm gonna be praying to an image and they can't even see me? Can't see you. You let me be somewhere and a statue turn his head and start <laughs> talking. Amen. When I was coming up, I remember watching a movie called Jason and the Argonauts. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, them big old statues start moving. Amen. You let, and you find how the devil blind people. Yeah. They lie, bleed in statues. <laughs> That's right. A statue that cries. That cries. A statue that shaves his beard. My Lord. A statue that used the bathroom. My Lord. Why he never used the bathroom? with other men. Amen. Why he only used the bathroom at night? All at night. Amen. Lord help him. You want to make money? All you got Amen. to do is tell a lie. That's, That's right. right. Got a statue in your house and say, you know what? The statue will cry. You will get all the media in the world. Yes, you will. And then start selling tickets to make money at your house. That's right. Amen. So you can keep your mortgage up. That's right. This is how blind and gullible people are. Amen. Listen. Eyes have they, but they see not. Eyes have they. Mm. The prophet Estrus talked about this and itemized it. That's right. Eyes have they. But they see not. Thank God I have to get that because he really itemized what they're doing. Mm. They have eyes, but see not. They have ears. They have ears. But they hear not. That means your idol God cannot answer your prayer. That's right. You down there praying to Mary, you down there praying to St. Michael, St. John, St. Jones, and St. Bobby, and St. Tommy, and St. Catherine. They can't help you. No, no. Mother Teresa can't help you. That's right. You got to call on God. That's right. Call on God, the living God. That's right. The Pope cannot make saints. 
That's right. The archbishops ahead, do not have the power to make saints. That's right. It is written, right. God will keep the feet of, of his saints. saints. Right. Right. Ain't no such thing. You become a saint after you die. No. The dead know nothing. That's right. If you don't live right to please God while you're living, you're going to get prepared to hell after you die. That's right. Glory to God. They have ears. They have ears. But they hear not. Hear not. Noses have they. Nose have they. But they smell not. Amen. Why don't, hey, why don't your statue that you bowing to, why can't it smell the bird droppings? That's right. Hanging all over his face. Amen. Dripping from his nostrils. That's right. Amen. So he can't even move his clay cement hand yeah. and go in the inner place that's right get all the droppings out that's right am i right noses have they you have a nose but they smell not you can't smell they have hands they have hands but they handle not that's right amen have you noticed every time you go pray to your god it's in the same position that's right they come three years later still there you came there when you was 12. Mm -hmm. You come back 24. That's right. You come back 65. When are you going to wake up? Amen. Human family, human family, you're mighty ignorant. That's right. When are you going to wake up? Amen. Well, Pastor Jennings, I love Jesus. He ain't tell you to put him on a cross and wear him around your neck no. and put him in your house no. and put him in a church? No. Get no, that clay trash out of your church. Get him out. That's right. Over right there, God, I wish I had an image. I would love to do some harm to it. That's right. Listen to what the word of God said. They have hands, but they handle not. They have hands, but handle not. Feet have they. Feet have they. But they walk not. You're just like the Israelites. Right. Here is great Jehovah, mm -hmm. great Yahweh, mm -hmm. the Lord God of the world, That's right, sir. brought them out the land of Egypt and delivered them from the hands of Pharaoh. That's right. And here is Moses or Musa up on the mountain. Mm -hmm. God Almighty laying the commandments to him. That's right. Israel rises up to play. Mm. Israel came along and made a calf. Made a calf. Made a calf. And after they made a calf in those days, they said the calf. Mm -hmm. Let me show you how you are, viewers. Israel said the calf brought them out the land of Egypt. Let me show you how dumb that was. Mm -hmm. They was already out the land of Egypt when they made the calf. That's right. That's right. They wait till they get out, right. then say, uh, the calf brought us out. Amen. That's exactly what you're doing. That's right. Here's the world been here. Amen. Then later on, you said God was born. God was born. That's right. The world been here. And then later on, you say, well, God was born. That's right. God is here before the world. Oh yes. Listen. They have hands, but they, they have handle hands, none. but can't handle nothing. Feet have they, but they walk not. Feet have they. But they walk not, neither speak they through their throat. How big is God? He's bigger than you. That's right. That's right. How wide is it? He's wider than you. Amen. Glory to God. In the book of the wisdom of Solomon. Listen at this. In the book of the wisdom of Solomon, chapter 14. What is it? And we're at verse 14. Come on, son. For by the vain glory of men. Listen. I want you viewers to listen at this. Give chapter and verse again. Wisdom of Solomon, chapter 14. And we'll start at verse 14. By the vain glory of men. They entered into the world. They came into the world. And therefore shall they come shortly to an end. Yes. For a father afflicted with untimely a mourning. A father that's afflicted with untimely mourning, meaning grief hit him, caught him mm. off guard. That's right. Unexpected. Mm. Uh -huh. When he has made an image of his child. When he made an image of his child. Soon taken away. Now, wait a minute. See, the father lost his child. Right. Child is dead. Mm -hmm. So to keep himself in remembering what the child looked like, he mm -hmm. make an image. Made an image. He make a statue. Mm -hmm. And like sometimes you got a photo album of your children. That's yeah. right. That's it. You see in the Old Testament, the Lord God says, make no image of me. That's right. That's why no one can sculpture God no. and say he looked like that. No, that's right. 
Right. Nobody. Yeah, nobody. You can't scope to God. No. Because you can't scope to someone that's higher than heaven. That's right. Deeper than hell mm -hmm. and broader than the sea. Where would you begin? That's Amen. Right. Where would you start? That's right. Here the book says the clouds are the dust of his feet. Mm -hmm. What size would you make his feet? That's right. The clouds are the dust of them. The dust. What size would you make his feet? Mm -hmm. Amen. Hmm? Amen. The book says out of his mouth mm -hmm. cometh a two-edged sword and his teeth is white like milk. That's right. But you take it literally. Amen. So That's some right. nutter come along and have two blades protruding out of his mouth Amen. and give him a good smile. That's right. Why? God Almighty talks in symbolic terms. Mm -hmm. To better understand it, viewer, in the study of Egyptology, mm -hmm. the history of the Egyptians, mm -hmm. they left their history yeah. written on the pyramids, right. written on columns, mm -hmm. written on walls. Not in the alphabet we have today, no. but it was written in symbols, right. shapes, mm -hmm. images, mm -hmm. signs. It is called hieroglyphics. hieroglyphics. And you got to have someone that's a master in interpreting the pictures, the signs, that's right. the hieroglyphics. That's right. The scriptures have divine hieroglyphics. Mm -hmm. Not only that, hieroglyphics is used today, mm -hmm. even in the world. Go yeah. and say, no, it's not. Oh, yes, it is. Mm -hmm. You got to be able to read hieroglyphics before you can get your driver's permit. That's true. <laughs> That's right. Huh? That's right. You got to be able to read the signs. Read you got to recognize that sign to be able to know that traffic emerging on the left. That's right. There ain't no words written there. No. It's an image there. Right. It's a sign right. that you know traffic merging in the left. That you know that the lane's about to split. That's right. There's a sign. You got to recognize it. Yeah. Hmm? That's right. Got to know what it meant. Slippery and wet. That's right. You got to be able to recognize the sign. That's right. What it means. Then be able to define it. Listen to what the book says. When he hath made an image of his child, when he made an image of his child that died, now honored him as a god. What now? Mm. That's what you viewers have done. That's right. That's why you got these old little dirty statues around your churches called Jesus. That's right. That's right. Made out of clay, mm -hmm. made out of plastic. Mm -hmm. Some of you, your Jesus, the paint is peeling off of it. That's Amen. Right. Amen. A paint peeling Jesus. That's right. That's right. Amen. Mary baby died. Oh yeah. And you made the baby God. That's right. You hear what it says there? And and his child soon taken away. The child soon taken away. Now honored him. Now you honor the child as a God. That's right. That child was not God. No. Why? God don't grow. That's right. And God don't learn. No. The Bible said Jesus grew in wisdom and in knowledge and in favor with God and with yeah. man. That's right. The spirit that was in that body or in that child, that was God. That was God. That's why when he died on the cross and yelled up the ghost, the God that was in him came on out of that no, no. body mm -hmm. and it was the spirit of the living God that descended to the lower parts of the earth. That's right. That speaks to the spirits that was in prison. That's right. Huh? And his child soon taken away. That's child soon taken away. Now honored him as a God. Now you honor him as a God. Which was then a which, dead man. Which was what? Which was then a dead man. Now, hold that and let me show you this. Mm -hmm. St. John 3.16 and then first epistle of John 3.16. Mm -hmm. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Glory to God. I want to show you what the preachers have made a Amen. lie. Mm -hmm. Give me first epistle of John 3.16 first. Mm -hmm. Let's get that and straighten out the lie they first, told on God. First John chapter 3 and at verse 16. What is it? Hereby perceive we the love of God. What's the subject? God. Hereby perceive we or understand we God's love. Because he, because he laid down his life for us. Right then the priests have said for years that means God died. That's right. That means God died because 
he laid down his life. Well, you overlooked a certain word says there. Mm -hmm. It says his life. His life. His life. That's right. His life. His life. He's making a declaration of ownership. That's right. He owned something. That's right. Now you got to find out who was it that he owned. That's right. What was it that he owned? Right. And when was the life laid down? That's right. St. John 316. St. John 316. What is it? For God so loved the world. The eternal creator loved humanity. That he. That he. Gave his own only begotten son. His only begotten son was his life. That's right. Eh? That's right. He laid down his life, his meaning life. he laid down his son. He laid down his flesh. And when the Bible says Go his ahead. son, that don't mean that the creator of the world has sex with a woman. That's right. Teach it, brother. It don't mean that. Teach it. Teach it. It don't mean that. That's right. No, Jabril didn't come to Mary and have sex with her. No. No. No, no. The I... God of heaven didn't come to Mary and have sex with her. That didn't say Glory to take God just like God Almighty formed Adam from the dust of the ground and brought him forth from the dust Go of ahead. the ground. He went back to the no. dust of the ground and formed the second Adam and brought him forth from the dust of the ground. That's right. Right. That's right. Glory to God, what you're talking. That's right. What did he say? We caught back in 1 John 3 16. What is it? Thereby perceive we Thereby the love of God. Thereby understand we God love. Because he because laid down, who? He, he laid down his life. God is spirit. You can't kill God. No. No, no. You can't kill God, but he laid down his life. His life. For us. For who? For us. When did it happen? In St. John 3, 16. Says what? God so loved the world. That's, that's for us. That's right. Huh? That's right. The world is to us. That's right. That he laid his life down for. That's why he says, for us. The us is the world. God so loved the world. God so loved us. That's right. <laughs> That's right. That's, That's right. what that is. Amen. God so loved us. That he, what did he do? That he gave his only begotten son. That's his life. That's his life. His only begotten son was that body of flesh and blood. That's right. The term begotten doesn't mean that God Almighty has sex with a woman. No, no. No, no, no. Uh-uh. No. God ain't having sex with nobody. That's right. I want to say that very clear to you overzealous, crazy Christians. Go ahead. Who talk about, I make love to That's Jesus. Right. That's right. Jesus don't love you that much. No, no. He Amen. don't want you in bed with him. No. Am I right? Then said Mary unto the angel. Mm -hmm. You crazy overzealous folk. Yeah. I just make love to Jesus. Oh, no, you don't. No, you don't. Mm -mm. You may wish, but it ain't happening. <laughs> That's right. That's foolish talk. That's foolish talk. That's going beyond what the book said. That's right. Just stay within the boundary of the book. That's right. That's right. All right, listen, I'm trying to make God like he's some flesh and blood fellow like you are. No. That flesh and blood that came out the house of David of the tribe of Judah mm -hmm. was the flesh and blood that God worked in. That's it. He worked in that body. That's right. And when he worked in that body, and that body fulfilled its course, then the body died, uh -huh. and then the eternal God that made the world got back That's in it. that body mm -hmm. and glorified it. That's it. He promoted it. Promoted it. He elevated it. That's right. He transformed it. That's right. And gave it a nature that it functioned by that it never functioned before. before. That's right. Let it function by all spirit. Amen. And got rid of all the blood. That's right. Which was the former life. Mm -hmm. eh? That's the right. The blood was the former life. Mm -hmm. And the spirit took the place of the blood. Mm -hmm. Listen. Wherefore God also has highly exalted Do you hear that? In Philippians chapter 2 and verse 9. Highly exalted him. And given him a name which is above every name. What is it? That at the name of Jesus. All right, you men mm -hmm. that claim you're God. <laughs> That's right. If you're God, why why your name ain't above his. That's right. You walk around names uh, Jack and you know Jill and Jason and uh, 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 Zizel and uh, Amen. That's right. All type of names. Amen. Ain't no one can be saved by your name. No. And giving him a name which is above his name every is name. Above every name. That at the name of Jesus. Wait a minute. The mm -hmm. book says what God did what? And give it. God did what? Give it him a God name. have highly exalted him. Wherefore God also has highly exalted him. Who did it? God. Who did it? God. That's the subject. And what did God do? Also has highly exalted him. And that same God did what? And given him a name. God did what? Given him a name. See, the name Jesus is a given name. That's right. And it was given from God. That's right. Mary didn't name her son. No. No, no. Mary didn't name her son. That's right. Let me show you that he had the name long before he was born. Give me Luke. Mm -hmm. 
Go with it, God. Give me Luke, the second chapter. That's you right. better move quick, son. That's right. That's My right. God, I'm building a good house by God's permission. Amen. Give me Luke, I believe, 221. Luke chapter 2 and verse 21. Listen. And when eight days were accomplished. When eight days were passed. For the circumcising of the for child. For the circumcising of the child. His name was called Jesus. His name was called Jesus. Which was so named which of the was angel. So named of the angel. Before. When before. When before. When before. When before. Before what? He was conceived in the womb. Before he ever got to the body. That's right. That's right. Before he got to the body. Before he was conceived. He already had the name. That's right. Huh? Amen. Well, the question is, where did he give it? That's Paul right. already told you that God had highly exalted him That's right. and give, give him, him a name. name. Now, when name. you was given to you, you inherited. That's right. Give the first chapter, chapter book of Hebrew. And at verse 4. Listen at Hebrews chapter 1 and verse 4. Being, set, being made so much better than the angels. What? Being made. Thank God. No. Oh, no. Being made. God is not made. That's right. God is spirit. That's right. The son of God or the man of God or the Messiah that right. was made. That's right. As a separation. Mm. Don't say this like you're preaching too. I ain't preaching no two gods. No. I'm talking about a nature that is human and a nature that's, that's divine. divine. That's right. God is in me. That's right. I'm not divine. That's divine right. Divine is in me. That's Amen. I'm human. That's right. And the human is not the preacher. No. The divine is the preacher. That's right. The human is the puppet. That's right. The divine That's is right. the puppet master. That's right. That's right. The divine pull the string. Yes, Make me move. That's right. Make me tell you you're going to hell. Amen. Huh? Amen. Make me tell you there's one way. That's right. There's one law. That's right. And there's one lawgiver. Amen. Amen. I'm just a puppet. That's it. The God, the right. God of heaven. Puppet master. That's right. That's why he make you speak in tongue. That's right. The master. That's right. And the spirit give utterance. Amen. Master, get in your mouth. Amen. Shift it any way he want. That's it. That's right. Go ahead. He said the holy men of God speak as they were and they were moved by the Holy Ghost. You got to be moved by the, by the master. That's right. Glory to God. Amen. Do you hear what it's Hallelujah. Being made. Being, being made. Being made. Being made. So much better than the angels. God is not me. No. God always was. That's right. Go ahead. God laid down his life, meaning he laid down that flesh That's that it. Mary birthed into the world. That's right. That was his life, his son. The word his son simply means his servant. That's it. His minister. That's right. His apostle. Mm -hmm. His student. That's right. Huh? Being made. Glory yeah. to God. That's exactly what it means. That's right. But the book says, now are we the sons, sons of God. God. Now are we the servants of God. That's right. Glory to God. That's right. Huh? Being made. Being made. So much better. So much better. Than, than the angels. Than the angels. As he hath by inheritance. As he hath by inheritance. Obtained a more excellent name than they. And let's see who gave it to him. Mm -hmm. Back, back in, to the book of back, Philippians. Back in Philippians chapter 2. Yes, sir. And at verse 9. Now he, it says he inherited that name. That's right. Who gave it to him. Wherefore God also hath highly exalted him. And giving him a name. And giving him a name. Which is above every name. And what is the name? That at the name of Jesus. That's it. That's the name. That's it. At the name of Earl. That at the name of Jesus. At the name of Bobby. That at the name of Jesus. Go ahead, brother. At the name of Jennings. That at the name of Jesus. At the name of Muhammad. That at the name of Jesus. At the name of Farad. At the name of Jesus. At the name of Moses. At the name of Jesus. Abraham. Jesus. Isaac. Jesus. Jacob. Jesus. Paul. Jesus. John. Jesus. James. Jesus. Peter. Jesus. No, Mary. Jesus. Mary. Jesus. I said Mary. Jesus. That's right. At the name of Jesus. Pope John Paul. That at the name of Jesus. Pope Benedict. At the name of Jesus. It's good teaching, brother. What should everybody do? Every knee should bow. You bow to anything else. Get up. Get up. Get up. That's right. That's right. That's we right. recognize no one as God but the God of heaven. Amen. Amen. Glory right. to God. That at the name of Jesus. What should, hallelujah, what should everything do? Every knee should bow. You bring your God here. Amen. I make anybody's God in the world lick it up. Lick it up. That's right. 
Right. Bring That's me right. any statue, any image, and bring me a man or a woman. That's right. And declare yourself to be God. Amen. And they show me what you made, what Amen. you brought into existence. Amen. Without using any material here. That's right. That's right. The Lord brought the non-existence into existence. Amen. Speak and everything just moved. To whom then will ye like it? It is written, he by the clap of his hands. Heaven and earth stood together. That's right. <laughs> That's right. Hey Amen. It's written that, that his eyes is 10,000 times brighter than the sun. That's right. And hear these little weak things that catch syphilis and AIDS and gonorrhea right. and everything else. And you talk about your God? God, my Lord. To whom then will ye liken me? God wants to know. Mm -hmm. Who will you compare him to? Or shall I be equal, saith the Holy One? Say if the holy three. Say if the holy one. No, the holy, the holy three in heaven. The holy one. The holy three. The holy one. One, two, three. Holy one. Just one. One. That's There's right. just one God here. Who hath directed the spirit of the Lord? Listen. In Isaiah 40 and at verse 13. All right. Listen at this. Who hath directed the spirit of the Lord? Who direct? What do you mean? Who's God's boss? That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Okay. Who? Who? Who tell God what you should do, what you should not do, when you should do it, how should you do it? No, who tell God that? That's right. That's right. What man That's right. can direct the wind? Amen. Someone said, well, wait a minute. Jesus did it. That man did it. No, he didn't. No, he You're didn't. wrong there. Jesus said, peace, be still. Right. Yes, he did say it, and he didn't say it. That's right. I just want to toss that at you. Toss that out. The man was simply used to rehearse what the inner man said. That's right. Don't you hear that man said, I do nothing. Of myself. I do nothing. Nothing. That's I right. want to get that and certify while we lay brick here. That's right. I do nothing. Nothing. Of myself. Now let's see what he was on when the wind was bolstering mm -hmm. and the waves was tossing. Amen. Jesus made it clear. Give chapter and verse. St. John chapter 8 and at verse 28. What? Then said Jesus unto them, when ye have lifted up the Son of Man, then shall you know that I am he. Yes. And that I do nothing of myself. I do nothing of myself. But as my Father but hath But as me, the Spirit hath taught or me. Or as the Creator mm -hmm. or as the inner man right. have guided me. I speak these things. Then now, I talk. Now in Matthew chapter 14. Notice. As the Spirit have taught me, right. I speak these things right. as the spirit have guide me i speak these things i speak that's right uh, what, what you mean i speak the, whatever god want that body to say that's i'm right. gonna say that's right now listen at the speaking of the spirit in a body in saint matthew chapter 14 and we'll begin at verse 20 listen at this but straightway jesus spake unto them saying be of good cheer be of good cheer it is i be not afraid hey, don't be afraid and peter answered him and said lord if it be thou, lord if, if it's you bid me come unto thee let me come on the let me come on out to you on the water and he's and he said, come. Wait a minute. Let's back up and see what he was doing that caused Peter to say that. Back at Matthew chapter 14 and verse 23. All right. And when he had sent the multitudes away, he went up into a mountain, a part to pray. Real quick. And when the evening was come, he was there alone. Yes. But the ship was now in the midst of the sea. The ship sea, was in the midst waves. of the sea, tossed with waves. For the wind was contrary. Yes. And in the fourth watch Notice. of the night. Notice. He's giving you a weather report. God, he's giving you a weather report here. What did he say happened? And in the fourth watch of the night, Jesus went unto them walking on the sea. What did he say happened? But straightway Jesus spake unto what them. What was the condition of the waters and the wind? But the ship was now in the midst of the sea. It was in the midst of the sea. Tossed with waves. Tossed. I want to establish the condition of things. Right. The ship was being tossed. Tossed with waves. With waves. For the wind was contrary. The wind was contrary. That's right. The wind got stubborn. Yeah. Hmm? Right. It was contrary. Mm -hmm. All right. And in the fourth watch of the night, Jesus went unto them. He went to them. Walking on the sea. He did what? Walking on the sea. Well, notice, those tossed waters didn't af affect him. No. All right, read on. And when the disciples saw him walking on the sea, they were troubled. They were, hey, I'll be troubled too. Mm -hmm. Why? A man can't walk on water. No. 
unless it's frozen. That's right. But the water wasn't frozen here. No. The winds were still tossing, or rather blowing, and the waves were still tossing. That's right. And here's Jesus walking on water. But remember, Jesus said, I do nothing of myself. He said, I do nothing. I do nothing of myself. But what was he doing here? Walking on the sea. But Jesus said what? I do nothing of myself. But what was he doing here? Walking on the sea. But Jesus said what? I do nothing of myself. But what was he doing here? Walking on the sea. That body was a puppet. That's right. Yes, sir. That's all it was. That's right. Guided by the Spirit of God. That's right. Spirit guided that body on the water. Read on. I do, and when the disciples when saw, the him, disciples walking the sea, saw him walking on the sea, they were troubled. They were troubled, saying, "It is a spirit." They, they said, "What? It is a spirit." That's, listen, they thought that what they was looking at was spirit. That's right. But the spirit that they saw or that they didn't see was in them. That's right. But the actual shape they looked at, they thought that was the spirit, and it wasn't. That's right. The spirit was in them. Mm -hmm. Listen. Saying, it is a spirit. It's a spirit. And they cried out for fear. They cried out. They were scared. That's, but straightway Jesus spake unto them. And said what? Saying, be of good cheer. Don't worry. It is I, be not afraid. All right, read quick. And, G and Peter answered him and said, Lord, if it be thou, bid me Let come. me come on out the water with you. And he said, come. And when Peter was come down you out know, of the You know, when the waves was tossing in the... And the wind blowing. Jesus spoke to the wind. That's right. On one occasion. And said, Peace. That's right. What you mean? Salam. Right. Peace. Salam. Salam. Prince of peace. Prince of Salam. That's right. Peace. Be still. Be still. But remember, I don't do nothing of myself. For how in the world are you telling the wind to stop blowing? Mm -hmm. But I do nothing of myself. That's right. But yet you tell Lazarus to come forth and he come out. That's right. And then you tell me you do nothing of yourself. That's right. You walk on water, you raise the dead, you declare I'm the resurrection and I am the life. And yet you can't do nothing on your own. That's right. And they came to him. Give chapter and verse. Now in Luke chapter 8 and verse 24. Says what? And they came to him. They came to him. And awoke him. And the what? And awoke him. He didn't wait, God. No. That's right. Came along and went to the house of David That's and right. put a suit on. That, and took some working him. clothes. That's right. And he called the working clothes a servant. That's right. And the working clothes, listen, my suit got to fall. Right. That's right. That's right. It has to fall. Right. I got to put it on. Right. My suit don't have behavior of its own. No. My suit do nothing of itself. That's right. But as I work in it, right. then it got to move. That's right. My, 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 my sleeve move. Right. What's in it move? That's right. My pants leg move. That's right. Because my leg move. That's right. That's all the Messiah was. Yes. A flesh. Mm -hmm. He was a suit. Mm -hmm. Until Paul said he was a veil. A veil. That's right. Went to the house of David. Slipped into a veil mm -hmm. to fit the spirit. Right. And it took on the shape of man. That's right. And then he used that shape that man can identify with to redeem man back to him. That's right. 
Huh? That's right. Glory to God. Do you get what I'm telling you? Amen. What he took on was not God. No. What he took on was a servant. Took upon him the form. He took upon him. That's right. He took it on. Amen. The form. Of a servant. Of a servant. And was made. And was made. In the likeness that of men. That flesh and blood was custom made. That's right. By heaven. Amen. That God was telling me, telling me, that's right. Telling me, Vaughn, that's right. Made so perfect, it didn't have no sin. That's right. Sir. That's right. <laughs> that's right. Amen. That's right. Amen. Come on and made it so perfect, he left all the sin out. That's right. You understand? Amen. All perfect and infallible. infallible. Just use it to bring man to him. That's right. His body was equivalent to an umbilical cord. Mm -hmm. It was designed to connect outer life to eternal life. That's right. Go ahead, go Everything ahead. you need to get fed, you go had ahead. to get it from him. That's right. That was an umbilical cord. Go ahead. That's why he said, no man come to the father except, except by me. By me. A right. child when it's in the body of the woman can't eat yeah. until the mother eats. That's right. Amen. That umbilical cord shows life is connected. Right. And the mother life is greater than the life of the child. That's right. The life of the spirit is greater than the life of the flesh. That's right. Did you get what I'm telling you? Go ahead. Go ahead. Glory to God. What did he say? Back in Luke 8 and at verse 23. What did he do? But as they sailed, he fell asleep. What? But as they sailed, he fell asleep. As they sailed, Jesus, the son of man. Mm -hmm. Son of man means son of a prophet. That's right. What you mean, son of a prophet? No prophet laid with the mother. No. Son of the prophet mean he came out the house of a prophet. That's right. It is written of a throne of his father, David, David. there should be no end. No end. David was his father. Mm -hmm. And yet what was in Jesus was David's father. That's right. Come on, son. But as they sailed, he fell asleep. As they sailed, he fell asleep. And there came down a storm of wind there on the lake. There came down. There came down a storm of wind. On the lake. On the lake. And they were filled with water. They were filled with water. And were in jeopardy. And what? And they came to him and, and awoke him, and saying, Master, Master, we perish. Master, Master. We perish. Master, we gonna die. Then he arose. Then he arose. And rebuked the wind. And chastised the wind. And the raging of the sea. And the raging of the sea. And, and they ceased. And there was a calm. Now, he spoke to the wind. Mm -hmm. Rebuked the wind. He rebuked it. That's right. But yet Jesus said, I do nothing of myself. But what happened? He did what to the wind? He arose and rebuked the wind. But yet Jesus said, I do nothing of myself. But who do it? He arose as my father, as my father has taught me. As my father have taught me, or as my father do well offend me, I speak. He doeth the work. That's right. As the spirit that dwell in me, he do the work. That's right. Why you think he tell us apostles? Mm -hmm. It ain't you that speak. What you mean? You ain't a preacher. That's right. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> he told the apostles, it ain't you that are preachers. Just speak. You can't take the credit. No, no. It's not you that speak who you think you are. That's right. The voice of my father speaketh in, speaketh in you. You need the spirit of the God spirit. to talk in you. That's it. That's right. I've been telling you, take God to make a preacher. That's right. That's right. And then after God make the man, then God get in the man, and then God speak out the man. Out the man. That's it. You fellas come along and say you God. Go create a planet and get in it. Amen. No man mm -mm. alive today Amen. is the Lord of the world. No, no. No man. No man. God is infallible. That's right. Go back to the book of the wisdom of Solomon. Mm -hmm. I want to increase some more on this idolatry. Amen. God being perfect, infallible, flawless. The creator of all things and the creator of all men. Mm -hmm. He is perfection. That's right. He don't have to overcome nothing. That's right. He don't strive to do nothing. That's right. That's right. He just do it and it's done. Mm -hmm. God has no beginning. Right. God has no ending. no ending. God never was born. God can't die. God don't. Pray. That's right. 
Don't say, wait a minute, Jesus prayed. The flesh prayed. The spirit don't need prayer. No. Anytime you pray, you pray into a source higher than you, and you need that source to help you. That's right. That's right. Why you think when his son was born, Gabriel told Mary, he shall be called the son of the, the highest. highest. Of the highest. Son of the highest. Right then, he lets you know there's a nature higher than what's being born. That's right. Son of the highest. There's a life. There's a life that's greater. It's greater. This life that's being born was a temporary life. That's right. It is written, those things that are seen are temporal, but that which is not seen, that's eternal. That's eternal. That's right. Are you listening? That's right. Come on, son. Back in the wisdom of Solomon chapter 14 and at verse 15. Yes. Now honored him as a god, which was then a dead man. Get the whole thing. For, for a father afflicted with untimely mourning, when he hath made an image of a child soon taken away. Yes. Now honored him as a god, which was then a dead man. Yes. And delivered to those that were under him ceremonies and sacrifices. Now, you that are watching, mm -hmm. there are some ethnic groups and some religions that have celebrations for the dead. They have it in Mexico. Yeah. That's right. Big celebrations for the dead. That's right. Sometime when a person died, they have a very large funeral. Mm -hmm. And then they try to put the drunk in heaven. Amen. Right then, some reverend got the drunk in heaven. Right. Sitting somewhere near Jesus. That's right. Hmm? That's Big right. Big celebration. Come on, son. And, and delivered to those that were under him ceremonies and sacrifices. Yeah. Thus, in process of time. In the, in the process of time. An ungodly custom grown strong was kept as a law this what happened mm -hmm. as a result of man making idols to commemorate the dead right a result as man making idols and images just to commemorate the dead an ungodly a custom ungodly custom came about that's grown strong. It grew strong. Was kept as a law. And it was kept as a law. That's why in some religion, it is law and it's doctrine to pray to images. That's right. You Hindus be praying to a fertility God and some other God. When I was in India, the ministers at the first church in, uh, in India, no, in the island of Mauritius, where there's thousands of of Hindus mm -hmm. and our brothers was former Hindus mm -hmm. they took me to the Hindu temples and the first idol God I saw oh my God he was tall mm -hmm. but uh, he was behind a glass wall mm -hmm. and there was a bell on the outside and the gentleman said you gotta ring the bell mm -hmm. I said why he said because this is the God that sleeps you got to ring the bell to wake him up. My Lord. Suppose he's exhausted and just don't want to get up, then what? That's right. Ungodly custom. Ungodly custom. You should not have in your home pictures or in your churches pictures that's supposed to be Jesus. That's right. Or supposed to be of some angels. Mm -hmm. Or supposed to be of Mary holding a baby who you claim is Jesus. That's right. Oh, that is a lie. Amen. That's right. The holy book says what? Thus in process of time, an ungodly custom. A ungodly custom. That's why you can see in the hospitals, they got chapels and always got images there. That's right. And people come down there holding the feet of the statues and crying, asking Mary to intervene. Let me tell you something. Mary is dead. Mary's dead. Don't know nothing. That's right. She is helpless. That's right. She have no power. Mm -hmm. God Almighty have never had a mother. No, never. Thank God. God don't have a daddy. That's right. Glory That's right. to God. Listen. Thus in process of time, an ungodly custom. The ungodly custom. Grown strong. It grew strong. Was kept as a law. It was kept as law. And graven images were worshipped by the commandments of kings. Did you hear that? Amen. Graving images were worshipped by men's commandments. Whom men could not honor in presence. They couldn't honor in presence. They, because they dwelt far off. They dwelt far off. They took the counterfeit of his vices from far. And what? And made an express image of a king whom they honored. Men are making statues of living men today. 
That's right. And now they are making that statue as a god. As a god. When you bow to anything, mm -hmm. bowing is a show of total submission. That's right. I pledge my allegiance. That's right. This is why we don't pledge our allegiance to a flag. That's right. Listen at me, viewers. Mm -hmm. Some of you may say, oh, I know that man went crazy now because he ain't patriotic. I most certainly am not. That's right. You ain't watching no patriotic man. No. I pledge my allegiance to God. That's right. You that are watching me, your children that go to school, mm -hmm. when they stand up to pledge allegiance, mm -hmm. let your children stand up. Mm -hmm. But you teach your children. Don't put their hand on no heart. That's right. They want to stand up. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. Don't say nothing. Amen. No hand on your heart. No. We pledge our allegiance no. to no country. That's right. How you going to pledge your allegiance to a country that allowed two men to get married? Amen. Oh, yeah. Are you listening to the old man? That's right. That's right. The holy book says what? They took the counterfeit of his vices from far. They took the counterfeit of the vices far. And made an express image of a king. Made an express image of a king. Whom they honor. Who they honor. To the end that by this their forwardness they might flatter him that was absent. Did you hear that? Mm -hmm. Flatter him that was absent. As if he were present. What do you mean? They make an image omnipresent. That's right. They make a mortal man today eternal. That's right. When you die, mm -hmm. you go to the grave. Go to the grave. Hmm? That's right. I don't care how many people you lead. I don't care how much power you think you have. If you're able to grow grass out of your ears. Hmm. I guarantee you when you go to the ground, the insects going to cut that grass. That, yes, they will. Huh? Then shall the dust. Do you hear? In the book of Ecclesiastes. Hey, Mr. Man, you puffed up, high-minding, beer-guzzling, woman-chasing, party-loving thing, you. That's right. Listen at this. In the book of Ecclesiastes. You dancing Christian. Amen. Listen. Ecclesiastes chapter 12 and verse 7. Let me show you where you are. Then shall the dust. Look at you. Amen. Dust that wear wigs. <laughs> Dust that wear ankle chains. That's right. Lipstick wearing dust. Mm -hmm. Earring wearing dust. Amen. Homosexual dust. That's a right. Dyke, a dyke, a dusty dyke. That's right. That's right. A dusty dyke. Amen. A dusty homo. Amen. You dusty bigot. That's right. Dust. Huh? Dust. I tell you are uh, dust. All the churches and mosques and synagogues. Amen. When the Lord God appear in the heaven yes. and ignite heaven and earth. That's right. He gonna burn creation down. That's right. That's right. Your imam won't be able to help you. No, no. Your rabbi mm -hmm. won't be able to help you. That's right. Your elder, your bishop. Bishop. Your slick head reverend. Amen. Your manicured nail reverend can't help you. No, no. Your Jerry Curl head preacher won't help you. That's right. Joel Austin will, and that smiling, will That's not right. soften the flames of hell. No, it won't. No, it won't, sir. Amen. Are you listening to what I'm telling you? Amen. You fellas walk around and keep partying and dancing and acting like a fool. Then the moment you get sick, you want Jesus. That's right. You better give God your life while you got strength while and while you have life. That's right. That's right. Go ahead, brother. The holy book says what? Then shall the dust return to the earth. You're going to die one day, sister. Amen. Brother, you're going to die one day. You millionaires that are watching me, I don't care how much money you have. No. Millionaires are already dead. Show me one where George Lincoln or Ben Franklin got him out the ground. That's right. You died and left your money behind. Mm -hmm. Amen. Huh? Then shall the dust. Your bars of gold didn't get you out. No. Some of you died and done got big, large tombs and lavish caskets. That's right. Walls decorated in gold and diamond engraved mint. And here you laying there stinking. Amen. Laying in there. 
big old crypt and you lay in there stinking. That's right. Huh? That's right. Worms eating up a so-called rich man. Amen. Are you listening? Yeah. Come on. Then shall the dust. I want to show you that you're nothing. Nothing. God is everything. That's it. We're nothing. That's right. That's I right. just want to show you you that think you're so cute. Mm -hmm. You think you're God gift to women and God gift to man. You ain't nothing, nothing. but a pile of dust that's yeah. switching your hips into hell. That's it. That's all. That's all. That's right. You cigarette sucking and big guzzling and cocaine snorting thing. Go ahead. When you die, Go you're going to stand before God. That's right. Where are you going? Then shall the dust return to the earth. Your mama can hold your hand and sing over you all she want. Yep. Hold your mama hand while you're dying. While you're mama, hold my hand. Mama, I can't see you. It's getting dark, mama. Sing me a song about Jesus. That's right. Read me a scripture. That's right. She read you something that don't hurt you. That's right. She read the Lord, my shepherd. My shepherd. That's right. I shall not want. Amen. All of you mothers who you know your child live like a student of hell. Mm. If they want you to read a scripture before they die, mm. here's my recommendation. Amen. Amen. Here's my recommendation. Mm -hmm. Give me the 16th chapter book of book of Mark. Mark. Mark chapter 16 and verse 16. Here's my recommendation to all you hellions. Mark chapter 16. Hellions. <laughs> That's right. Thing that want to live like the devil out of hell and then don't want God until you about to die and leave here. Amen. Then all of a sudden you want to make a declaration, I'm a Christian. You's a hellion. That's right. The word of God says what? He that believeth and is baptized. All right, you that's dying full of liquor. Mm-hmm. Full of cigarettes. Amen. Girlfriends lined all around your bed. That's right. Want to know who's going to take care of the babies that you left them? That's right. Here it is. He that believeth. He that believeth. And is baptized. And is baptized. Shall be saved. Shall be saved. But he that believeth but not. But the unbeliever. Shall be damned. You're going to hell. That's it. Yeah, that's right. Read that to them. Right. He that believeth and is baptized. Here's the scripture saved. we recommend. Right. right. You be baptized and obey God, you'll be saved. But he that believeth not, he don't believe, shall be damned. But he's dying, shall be damned. But he hold his mama's hand. He that believeth not shall be damned. But the priest is sprinkling some water around him like smoked turkey. He that believeth not shall be damned. <laughs> but he's holding bees while he in the bay yelling, Hail Mary, full of grace. He that believeth not shall be damned. Them bees won't help you. No, they won't. Thank God the bee's not even real enough to help you. That's right. That's right. You hold a chain. Amen. God don't put power in bees. No. no. That's right. Power in his word. I want to shake your foundation. That's it. The reason why God wants this to be, he wants the whole world mm -hmm. to trust him. That's it. That your confidence in rabbit foots and bees and lucky charms like you got confidence in a box of cereal. That's right. Full of surprises. Amen. Amen. Purple hearts, <laughs> yellow moons, right. and green horseshoes. That's right. <laughs> That's right. You get what the old troublemaker is telling you. Right. Amen. The book says what? He that believeth not shall be damned. Hmm? Amen. You walk around now like you're not going to die. God proves to you, fella, that you are not God. That's right. He proves it to you. He proves it. My God, that's why when something happened to you, you start crying out to God. That's right. Hmm? Amen. You walk around all tough and all bad and all sharp and cussing everybody out, uh -huh. thinking you bad with your hands and you can hold you on. Yeah. My moment you get in jail or get shot. Mm hmm Jesus. That's right. Moment you hear your breathing start changing. That's right. That's right. I, I don't know who you are up there. That's right. Oh, I don't yeah. know your name. Mm -hmm. Man I want to talk to the man upstairs. That's right. Please. That's right. Please. That's right. Please. That's right. Save me. That's you know why? He no hell waiting on him. Wait. Amen. Right. He knows you now. He no hell waiting on him. That's right. I don't care how much of a Christian your mom and daddy is. Mm -hmm. Children, Amen. you don't obey God, hell waiting on you. Hell waiting. That's right. That old reverend can give the nicest sermon he can give that he wants. Mm -hmm. 
They ain't gonna help you when you die. One dieth in his fool. That ain't gonna help you when you die. That's right. Amen. Some of you silly crackheads and beer guzzling. Here's your friend get shot down, and you stand at the grave site and pour liquor yes. over his coffin, you fool. That's a fool. And you done something honorable. That's right. The last thing you do to me is pour whiskey all over my face. That's right. Kind of right. honoring that. Amen. That's my homie, man. That's my dog. Hmm. My dog lamb there, man. Wanna show our respects. He's already going to hell. You ain't gotta wash him down there. That's right. Right. Some of you are so ignorant, you throw little bags of cocaine yeah. down, in hell. down in hell. You think the grave diggers gonna let that stuff get away? <laughs> no, Thank no. God, the grave digger, by the time he done snorking that stuff, he gonna be digging graves for folk that ain't even dead yet. That's right. He just gonna be digging. <laughs> That's right. Huh? That's right. Cocaine got him doing it. Amen. Amen. Here you are getting older and you still doing the same dumb Amen. thing you've been doing since you was 13. Amen. Hanging out on the street, drinking, smoking, and gambling, Amen. running and doing everything you want to do. Go ahead, go ahead. Ain't made no changes. No. Just becoming an older, older fool. Amen. And now you want young women to think you're not old, so you dye your hair. That's right. That's right. That's right. Die your hair all you want, you old fool. Old fool. When you stand before God, yes. and He gonna knock all that black dye out of you. That's right. That's right. Get what I'm telling you? Amen. Wear your wigs, get your Botox in your face, yes. get your plastic chest and your rubber hips. Go ahead. But when you stand before God, Go ahead. and that rubber wax and melt away. That's right. When your right. body start waxing away. Waxing away. The world make a fuss mm -hmm. when a celebrity died. Yeah. When Michael Jackson died, they put him in heaven. Right. Yes, they did. Princess Diana died. Mm -hmm. right Nothing but a British hoe. That's right. <laughs> Well, she was looking for love. Anytime a woman is married and she's chasing men, she's a hoe. That's right. That's right. Well, she's a queen, queen hoe. That's right. That's a royal hoe. Amen. I don't take it back. No. We'll sue you. Come and get me. You don't see me ducking. That's right. That's right. Tell the truth. Go ahead. You call a spade a spade. Go ahead. Amen. Go ahead. Yeah, many of you that are here and that are watching me, some of you fellas been doing the same thing since you've been born. Mm -hmm. All you do is party all night, party. club every weekend. Mm -hmm. And then just go to some church on Sunday to feel relieved. That's right. A choir sing and a pastor, it massages your sin. Yeah. Right. Then when you die, they march you in on going up yonder. Oh, That's what they did to Michael Jackson. Yeah. That's right. All that moonwalking. Then they march them in on going up yonder. That's right. Where is the yonder? Where is it? God don't care nothing about your celebrity status. No. Who in the world is greater than him? That's right. Who in the world is better than him? Amen. Who in the world is more powerful than him? That's right. Look at the way God had it. Go ahead. The king and the poor man got to stand before God. That's right. You blind white bigots that can't stand black folk. You blind black bigots that can't stand white folk. That's right. When both of you die, of you got to stand before the same God. That's right. That's right. You low lowlifes that call yourself Christian clansmen that hide under your underwear, Amen. hide under a sheet, and you blind one that's in the Black Panthers talking about black power. Yes. There is no power, power but, but that but which is God. ordained of God. That's right. Amen. That's the power that we have. That's right. That's right. You mean to tell me the only power you got is in the fist? My Lord. No power. There ain't no power. No. 
You white sheep wearing bigots. Amen. The only power you got, I see these white bigots mm -hmm. yelling white power. Right. You're a white fool. That's a fool. You black bigots Amen. yelling black power. Mm -hmm. Why you's a black fool? For there is oh, no power. Do you hear this? In Romans 13 and verse 1. What is it? There is no power. Oh, yeah, it's a little bit power. No power. Black power. No power. White power. No power. Yellow power. No power. Brown power. No power. The White House. No power. Parliament. No power. Amen. Amen. I told you. For there is God no power. rules. That's right. God is the boss. That's right. You're going to answer to him. Amen. Your gold, Amen. your car collection, That's right. That's your right. mansions. Mm -hmm. That don't impress God. No, no. When God get ready, he kill you. That's right. And then all that stuff you glory in, mm -hmm. you don't have now. You don't have it. That's right. That's right. They just set aside a day to honor your absence. That's right, sir. That's right. That's it. But that day don't bring you back. No, no. Come on, son. For there is no power but of God. You know, this is some good, tough stuff. Oh, yes. There's what? There is no power but of God. There is no power. That's right. But of God. The, the, the powers that be. What did it say? The powers the that be. The powers that be. Are ordained of God. That don't mean the power that violate God. No. White power. That's right. Black power. Mm -hmm. Brown power. Yeah. You are discolored fools. That's right. That's right. White man hate a black man because he's black? Because he's black. A black man hate a white man because he's white? Mm -hmm. Only white folk gonna be in heaven. My Lord. Years ago, white folk used to say only they gonna be in heaven. And if there's any black folk gonna be there, they gonna be in the kitchen. My Lord. Angels frying chicken. My Lord. <laughs> yeah, that's what a lot of big old bigger white folk used to say. My Lord. Racist mentality. Racist mentality. Yes. And then some of you blind black people, you come along, <laughs> only one gonna be in heaven is all black. All black folks. God is not ignorant. No. After this I beheld. Listen. In Revelation chapter 7 and verse 9. Thank God I want to hit as much as God moved me to hit. After this I After beheld. After this I looked. And lo, a great multitude. A great, no, a great black multitude. A great multitude. No, a great white multitude. A great multitude, which no man could number, of all nations. No, just black folk. Of all nations. Amen. Do you hear? Of all nations. Ain't no nations. black power in here. No. Ain't no white power in here. No, no. Only thing in here is the power of God. That's right. Amen. That's right. Amen. Why? That endure forever and ever. Yes, Amen. The holy book says what? Of all nations. Of all nations. And kindreds. And kindreds? And people. People? And tongues. All the different languages? Stood before the throne. They all stood before who? Stood before the they throne. Stood before God. And before the Lamb. And before the Lamb. Clothed with white robes. Clothed in white robes. And palms in their hands. And palms mean they got victory. That's right. Huh? That's right. Palms in their hand mean they got victory. They was victorious. God brought them through the battle. That's right. Huh? Amen. That's what that is. God brought them through the battle. And cried with a loud and voice. And cried with a loud voice. Saying salvation and to the, our God. Listen, the prophet saw the same thing. Mm -hmm. When he saw in the Old Testament, the book of Esther, he saw the crowd gather. That's right. And there was one among them that was taller That's or taller higher than every man. That's right. <laughs> Glory to God. Right. Didn't they say so? That's right. He was taller or higher than every man. That's right. The reason why he was taller because he was highly exalted. He was superior. That's King right. of kings. That's right. And Lord of lords. That's right. Right. Notice the book of the prophet Esther. Esther chapter 2 and at verse 46. Second Esther. Second Esther chapter 2 and verse 46. Read quick, son. Then said I unto the angel. Then said I to the angel. What young person? What young person? Is it that crowneth them? Is this that's crowned them? And giveth them palms and in their hands. give them palm in their hands. So he answered and said he unto me. He answered and said to me. It is the son of God. It is the son of God. Whom they have confessed whom in the world. Whom they have acknowledged in the world. Then began I greatly then to commend began them. Then I greatly to commend them. That stood so stiffly. That stood stiffly. For the name of the what Lord. What you mean? They endured. They were sound. That's Standing right. stiff mean they were sound. That's right. They were stable. That's right. Stiffly mean they were Set fast. That's right. They were settled, mm -hmm. unmovable. Stiffly right. means they didn't compromise. Go ahead. Stiffly means they held on to what was written. Go ahead. Go ahead. 
I'm standing stiffly. stiffly. And what's written here? That's right. That's not right. moving. That's right. Not bending at all. Go ahead. What did he say? Then began I greatly to commend them. I began to commend them. That stood so that stiffly. That stood so firm. For the name of the Lord. For the name of the Lord. Then the angel said unto me, Go thy way. You go your way. And tell my people. You tell my people. What manner of things. What manner of things. And how great wonders of the Lord thy God thou hast seen. Do you see that? Amen. And the Apostle John saw the same thing. Same thing. All, nations, all nations, all languages, all tongue and kindred. That's right. And you fools talking about black power, white power. My Lord. You can see the different uh, ethnic groups picketing, mm -hmm. holding rallies. Mm -hmm. Talking about let's bring the country back to its original stage, all white. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. Huh? Right. And then they quote from the Constitution, we the people, mm -hmm. for the people, That's right. by the people. Yeah. My Lord. Well, you're going to meet God, America. That's right. And the rest of the world. The of the world. You're going to meet God. Yeah. This going to church because it's Sunday, not going to help you. No, no. The truth of God is the telecast that God ordained to call your attention to his way. That's right. You want to know what God wants you to do? Mm -hmm. You watch the truth of God. Watch the, that's right. You want to know how to obey God? Mm -hmm. Stick with this. That's right. It'll put you on the right track. Amen. You may not like it, but at least you're on the right track. That's right. It may hurt you, but it'll put you on the right track. That's right. It may offend you, but it'll put you on the right track. Amen. These are the religions. Sugar baby. Yes, they are. Your pastor is a sugar daddy. That's right. And makes sugar babies. That's right. That's why you love to go to them churches where you get to run around the church. Run around the church. Like you suffering from ulcers. Amen. That's right. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> running around the church. No truth is preached. No. No. God want to make a people. He ain't trying to make a black people or a white people. No. He want to make a holy sanctified people. Thank you for listening, brothers and sisters. Amen. Now, we cover quite a bit of ground today. We bear witness only God himself is the supreme one. He have no rivals. He have no partners. We associate none with him. To some, I sound mean. Ignore what I, the way I sound and pay attention to what we're telling you. If you know you're not a bigot, then my white brothers won't get offended. If you know you're not a bigot, my black brothers won't get offended. If you get offended, you know you're a bigot. When we preach against homosexuality, you know you ain't gay, you won't get offended. But if you get offended, you know you're a faggot. Huh? That's right, Father. Glory to God. Amen. This evening, God willing, we'll be back at the headquarters temple. Who can give me the correct time, brothers? 320, thank you very much. Uh, we'll be back. Anyone who desire to be baptized in the name of the Lord Jesus and get your sins washed away. If you bow your head and raise your hands and did all that junk, you ain't saved. You're still in your sins. You went to some church and held some preacher's manicured hands and tell you don't pray the sinner's prayer. No such prayers in the scriptures. You've been duped. You've been conned. You've been bamboozled by a hustler. You went to a Catholic church and hid in the closet because the priest wanted to get to you. And you said seven Hail Marys. Then you went to an upright toilet bowl and the preacher threw water on your head. You ain't never been baptized. Amen. If you're a member of the house of prayer for all saints, Daddy Grace, and you got a fire hose shooting water on you, you ain't baptized. You know, when I was little, we was in the hood, we turned the fire hydrant on. In the summertime, to cool off. And that's pretty much what you've done. You must repent of your sins, meaning you must be godly sorrow for your sins. Sorry about them. 
And when you are sorry about your sins, I mean be sorry about them. Not just say, I am sorry. True repentance comes from in here. In here. Anybody can say, I'm sorry, but really don't mean it. Repentance is something you feel. You got to feel that remorse. Then you're ready to go down in water. And be baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. You cigarette sucker, you need to do that. You dyke, you need to do that. Some of you men here that's wearing pants today, but you're going home and put your dress on, you need to do that. That's right, that's right. That's it, brother. You're on the down low. In fact, you're too low. Am I right, men? Am I right, I say? Talk back to me. Glory to God, you're a little bit too low. <laughs> you're on the down low. If I got any gay men here, you're welcome. Come on, you, you come on in here. This is where you need to be. Oh, dear God, if you got any sugar and spice and too much nice, come on in here. This gospel we preach will toughen you up. It'll give you calluses back on your fingers. And make your hands all rough again. Bring ashiness back to your knees. <laughs> you understand? It'll pick you up, change you and convert you. I had many folk write me. I, I think you got some men there on the down low. Probably do. Probably do got some fellas around here that got some spice in them. That's all right. Thank God we're going to take all your spicy canisters and empty them and fill them all up with salt. Jesus said salt is good. Salt is good. I ain't going to treat you no different than anybody else. I'm going to talk to you and preach to you and preach repentance to you and baptize the flower. Thank God so the water can cause them to wither. Eh? You get what the old troublemaking is telling you. To my guests, we thank you for taking the time out to come and not go to your devilish church today. And don't go next week. In fact, don't go back again. You know the churches that is in Chester and Exington, you know they of the devil. You know your pastor is not a preacher. Because if he was, he'd be preaching the same thing that you hear us preaching. There's only one truth. There's only one message. And that message for it to be right, it got to come from the book. Not some of it, all of it. It got to come out the book. It don't come out the book, it's no good. So I want to say to you that are here, come out of your churches. Repent of your sins. Be baptized in water in the name of Jesus Christ. Humble yourself, tough man. You see, if you're so tough, you can fight off death. Hmm? See, can you jab at the death angel when he changed your breathing? When your heart started getting irregular? See, can you fight that off? The whole world need God. Even if you don't like what I'm saying, look at your neighborhoods. Look at our neighborhoods. My God, our young people are dying like flies. Our single young sisters are becoming mothers at 12. Young men or young boys becoming fathers at 13. Can't even aim straight at a toilet. That's right. Can't even afford a roll of toilet paper. Amen. But yet, our young girls, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, now pregnant, babies having babies. Right. Young boys being sodomized, being turned into homosexuals. Right. At 10, 11, and 12. Yeah. By the number. Yeah. I was watching Oprah, I believe, a few weeks ago interviewing a young white young boy she asked him when did you realize you was a homosexual he said when he was seven he knew it was something different about him I heard men say that it was a the girl was down inside of him there was a girl inside no that was a feminine spirit inside it's a spirit Are you listening? 
So if I got any men struggling with a girl inside. Hmm? Amen. Did Stephen have Stephine inside? That's right. <laughs> if Dan have Danielle inside? <laughs> if Brian have Brenda inside? <laughs> if Raj have Regina inside? <laughs> to God. This message will put you on the right track. Whatever you're struggling with, this message will help you. Don't run from it. Run to it. Yes, it's tough. Do you know sin is a tough thing? You can't deal with sin going to church and all the preacher doing it. Bad sinner. Bad sinner. No. You need something that's going to hammer you. Hit your heart. Sin is a tough thing, isn't it? You young men, look at your fingertips, how brown they are. Smoking. Look at how your eyes are changing color from liquor look how black your lips become from smoking for what killing yourself who are you killing yourself for if I had to do this man that woman man she just messed my head up man <laughs> dog I just can't help it you you know that woman got me on the bottle you mean to tell me you a woman got you killing yourself and then when you dead, she's still going to be alive and get the next one. That's right, sir. Think, get yourself together. That's right, sir. Get yourself. Women, get yourself together too. That's right, Amen. Amen. Are you listening? Men got you on the bottle, getting drunk, worrying about because he won't look. He ain't look at me today. Oh, God. Oh, oh. <laughs> You better watch me. You better get yourself together now. Because I'm telling you, life is not stopping for nobody. You're getting older, and yet you're not getting no better. Learn the ways of God. Repent of your sins, human family. Be baptized in the water in the name of Jesus Christ. Come out of those religions that opposes God and walk with God's divine truth. After we give our closing prayer, or one of our ministers will close us out with prayer, I'm going to ask all of our brothers not to leave. I want you to remain seated so I may go over some things with all of our brothers that are here. And the sisters, they can dismiss themselves. The mothers, I'm going to ask all of our mothers to please sit in the back so I can meet with you first before I meet with all of our brothers brothers. There's some things I need to go over, things of a vital importance with all of our mothers. And I need all of our mothers' cooperation. And to all of our brothers, we will get a chance to go over some very important things with you as well. To our brothers from the Baltimore, Maryland Temple, God willing, Friday evening at uh, 7